Hi guys, so in this video we're going to be going over how to create a Java project from scratch within VS Code. Uh, now this isn't something that you're generally going to need to do within this course. Um, generally you'll be downloading pre-made projects um, to use within VS Code, um, but it's still a useful thing to be able to do, so we're going to go over how to do it. Um, so you can see here I have VS Code open, but I don't currently have any folders open. Uh, I'm not working within any projects. Um, so we're going to go ahead and click open folder. Um, and then I'm going to click new folder. And then the name that I give this folder is going to be the name of my project. Uh, so I'll give it a very creative name. There we go. Um, and then we can just select folder. It's going to reload VS Code. And now we're working within our folder example project. Um, now, if I want to add a file to this project, I can just hover over here, click New File. Um, and then it's just important that you, when you're creating uh, files within a Java project, that they end in .java. So I'll call this one hire.java, enter. And then you can see down here, it is activating extensions. Um, so it will do this when you create a new file. Um, so it might just take a second for things to start working. Uh, within a new file um, just while it activates the extension. So just be aware of that. Um, now, if I want to create my new class higher, um, I can just type class. If I go down one here and click enter, it's going to auto complete for me. Um, I can do the same thing with the main method like so. And then you can see the run and the debug buttons have appeared. Um, so that looks like everything's working so far. Okay, so now let's go ahead and create the method higher uh, so that we can run something and see how it all works together. Um, so we're going to create the method higher. Um, it's going to take two parameters, parameter x and parameter y, both integer values, and it's going to return the higher, uh, oops, higher of the two values. Okay. So we'll go down here, we'll go and create the method, not void, int, um, int higher, int x, int y, and then we'll say if x is greater than y, then we want to return x. Otherwise, we want to return y. Okay, so now that we've got that method completed, we can go back up to our main method and we'll just create a few variables. We'll say int a equals 25, uh, int b can equal negative 25, and then we'll say int c equals higher a b. Um, and then we can go ahead and create a print statement. Um, the higher of 25 and negative 25 is, and it will be the result of higher a, b. Um, and then if we go ahead and click run, um, we can see in the terminal, we have printed the higher of 25 and negative 25 is 25. Um, so that's just a quick tutorial on how to start up your own project um, with your own Java files within VS Code. Um, so I hope you found this helpful and thank you for watching.